And even though COVID-19 and the quarantine have halted sports, college recruiting obviously has not stopped, especially if you're Jackson State. This past week, they've signed three basketball players to become Tigers. Overall, in this incoming class, they have four new signees, three of them who've already played some level of college ball, only one who'll be a four-year player out of high school. Now, Jackson State is losing some of its core players from this past season, so we talked to Coach Brent to hear what he was looking for with these new recruits. Uh, so I, I think we addressed a lot of the problems that we had from, from, from our guys that we lost. I, I think the first thing we had to do, we had to find some size on that baseline because we were losing everything except for uh, Jay. Uh, on that on that back line. So I thought we did a great job of, of addressing those needs. Yeah, you got to get some size. What you saw from that graphic earlier, coach is right. They definitely addressed it. He mentioned Javius McKinnis from Brandon. He's returning for his junior year. McKinnis was the SWAC defensive player of the year this past season and will likely play a larger role with the absence of their second leading scorer, Roland Griffin, who was also a presence down low. So outside of the players they have coming in, the main core of Tigers will be the likely preseason SWAC player of the year, Tristan Jarrett at guard. Murrah grad, Jonas James running the point, and Brandon Bulldog, Javius McKinnis down low.